Hey, what's up YouTube and welcome back to the channel. As far as we receive a new jailbreak and I'm talking here about the Uncover and the Chimera jailbreak starting from iOS 11 up to 12.2. So let's go ahead and talking about some tweaks for that new jailbreak. Before I'm gonna be start today's video, let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up. Also make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a week's video. Let me start with the first one and let me talk about the Chrome Home Bar X. This one has been updated right now and even the developer, he add more other stuff and you can check that out from the under the settings. So first of all, go ahead and enable the tweak and also you have right now different kind of styles. So if you tap on the style, you can see right now here we have four to five different kind of style. The general settings here, you can even customize that if you want to go to the wave settings here, you can customize that if you go ahead and tap on it, you can see right now, you can use left to right and the right to left. You can play around with the animation, also you have different kind of sliders, you can choose the fade color, you can choose the edge color and you have some other customized stuff that you can go through. Right now, once you're done from all those configurations, just you need to do the one more step, which is to re-spring your device so your device will be take the effect. And this is the way about that tweak right now, how can be work. And even you can tell, you can see right now here that I use already the style that the bar just change his color by himself. Anyway, so this is the first week and once again, if you guys looking to download this week, the tweak called Chrome Home Bar X and let's start right now talking about the next one. The next one, let me talk about the switcher style. You can tell right now, this is a different kind of switcher, even the background, even the style or the cards right now, once you download that week, which is in my opinion, is going to be really beautiful. Okay, so if we go ahead right now and jump under the settings, you can see right now here that we have some toggles here you can enable, you can disable by yourself, you can go through. So the one that I use right now is the square corners, I already toggled that and also the style which is looks different so you can customize that by yourself, you can choose the center icon, you have to keep in mind even you can place the cards one on the top of each other. You can see right now here even we have another customized stuff for your background of that switcher so you can use the light background, no blur, more blur which one that I use right now, you can see I already choose the more blur. Once you're done from all those configuration, because we have a lot of different kind of stuff, you need to make sure to re-spring your device and your switcher will be just like that. In my opinion, it's gonna be really beautiful. And once again, if you guys are looking to download this one, this one called Switcher Style. Let me right now talking about the next CD at week, the home list. This is a demo for that week. If you want to download the tweak, this one you have to purchase to get that tweak. It costs about like four dollars. So this is how is the tweak is gonna be looks like, which will be bring most of the tweaks and even the apps in one single page and even you have different customized stuff you can do that from under the settings so if you go under the settings right now of that tweak first of all go ahead and enable the tweak if you want to use the haptic feedback enabler you can toggle that and also if you want to hide the scroll bar you can hide that if you want to hide your deck which is the one that i use right now you can hide your deck you can bring your deck back on also, we have another session which is going to be for your settings or the button settings here. You can choose the light or the dark mode. 
also we have another section which is going to be the background blur so you can choose no blur the light or the dark mode as i show you guys also if you want to play around with your uh, reduce of the corners you can do that once you're done from all the configuration go ahead and resupprint your device and as i show you guys this week you have to pay for it this one is the demo to just showing you guys how is that week will be work and most of the stuff that we have under the settings Anyway, if you guys looking to download this one, this one called Home List. Next CD Week will be really amazing and I think most of you guys are gonna like it. So this one called B Zone. So once you download this one, this one will be allow you to change or charge. Sound will be different once you want to plug your device on a charge. This will be provide you with more than ring tune. So basically once you go under the settings, go ahead and enable the tweak. And also if you want to use the vibrate on charge, you can toggle that if you want to change the charge sound you can just toggle here that will be provide you with more than option for example here let me just go through for not all of them to just show you guys and you guys can listen for it the camera flash cancel and we have the charge activated computer usb also we have the google event here we have the ios popcorn magic tune the regular notification, the special tune, the one that I use right now, which will be the special tune. And also we have more than stuff if you guys looking to download those. So this is the most of things about Bezo once you download it in your Jello working device, as I told you guys. It will be make you to change and choose any kind of charge sound in your iDevice. Anyway, once again, if you guys looking to download this one, this one called Bison. Let me go ahead right now and talking about the next CD tweak. Next one will be the unsub. So the unsub, as you guys can tell, it will be disabled the tweak injection in any app. So what it does is sometimes you download a tweak, that tweak you want to just disable it and at the same time you want to keep it in your iDevice. So better than go under the settings and disable the tweak and resupring your device, you can go ahead right now, just go ahead and install the tweak and the tweak will be stopped so once you go back on and enable the tweak from the unsub it can be work once again how you can choose that go ahead and just disable the tweak injection in any apps from near go ahead and just enable the one that you're looking for go ahead right now resupring your device and you will be see the tweak or the one that you like to disable it will be stopped working you want to enable it just go back again on the unsub and untoggle that app or the application that you want to the tweak to work on it resupring and it will be work back again in my opinion this is going to be really useful this is what pretty much the unsub will be provide you with once you download it in your iDevice so anyway guys this is the most tweak that i want to share with you guys in today's video so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video don't forget give the video a huge thumbs up and also make a short subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a new video catch you with the next one peace